It's time for the weekly No Pain, No Gain Market Update with the team at Payne Capital Management here in New York City. Good morning. This is Bob Payne, Chief Investment Strategist here at Payne Capital Management. As the markets hover near all-time record highs and the year 2020 approaches its final month, I'm reminded of one of my favorite expressions, what my children affectionately or not so affectionately refer to as a Bobism. And that's time passes and markets operate. And neither cares how you feel or what you think. 2020 should be proof to all that no one knows what will happen, or more importantly, how global markets will react to whatever ultimately does happen. Had I told all of you at the beginning of the year that a global pandemic would completely alter life as we know it, kill over 1 million people, shut down the economy for several months across the globe, and hit an unemployment rate not seen since the Great Depression, would you have guessed that the market would be up 13% by Thanksgiving just 11 months later? Many of you are asking, Bob, how can this possibly be with the media's daily reminder that winter is coming, that the reopening will be closing as cold weather drives people indoors, allowing COVID's second wave to spread? Once again, no one really knows. But as history demonstrates, bad news isn't always bad news for the stock market. See, markets are efficient and they reflect the conventional opinions, hopes, and fears of every investor at the time. Now, if you're thinking it, and I'm thinking it, it's already incorporated into the prices. It's old news, and the forward looking market is focused on the news that's yet to come. It's already moved past the here and now. The economy, which is basically all of us, is very good at overcoming whatever life happens to throw at us, including, as it turns out, global pandemics. As today's highs in the market demonstrate the importance of not reacting to the volatility caused by the noise of conventional thinking, a painful and enduring lesson learned by anyone who sold in October, fearing a new lockdown in the economy or trying to gain the election, as prices quickly rose 10% from where they sold. Enduring vicious short-term drops in the market require patience and resolve, and certainly it's never fun or easy. Like all short-term corrections, they happen fast and when we least expect them. 2020 is almost over, proof once again that time passes and markets operate and neither cares what any of us think or how any of us feel. Stay invested. If you're thinking to yourself right now, do I have a portfolio appropriate to my risk tolerance, appropriate to my goals, my dreams? Why well, sit there and wonder when you could know? My son, Rye, and I have 65 years of combined industry experience of building low-cost, tax-efficient, goal-based portfolios. All you have to do is text or call 844-752-6692. That's 844-752-6692. Or just simply call 844-PLAN. NYC. That's 844-PLANNYC. Hey, this is Bob Payne. I'm the Chief Investment Strategist of Payne Capital Management.